Okay, continuing on with some jigs on my wall of jigs. Here's a horn bending clamp. You can see a piece of horn in the center. Uh, there are two metal pieces uh, to prevent the wood from getting wet. And there's also two curved pieces of wood. So this would be used by a club maker after they dunk the horn into some very hot water, it would become softened and then the horn can take the shape of whatever curve you want or you could make it flat if you want. In this case, uh, uh, on making this club, I needed the horn to be a little curved. You can see here that you can see there's a little curve to that horn when I compare it to the straight edge. Not much, but a little bit. But if I used a perfectly flat piece, I would have the horn sticking out on these ends too much and it wouldn't make good contact. The horn is not very flexible unless it's really thin. So if you ever see a club with a curved horn or an arced horn like this, it tells you that it's probably handmade rather than machine made. Here's a photo of Robert Forgan's shop and a lot of the workers are holding various tools. But there's something here that if you look close up and I'll show you a close up, uh, it says, I think it says horn. And I don't know if this is a piece of horn or not, but uh, I'll show you a close up of that and, and we'll see. So to me, it looks like it says H-O-R, maybe horn. I think it says horn on, on here. And it looks like there is a piece of horn next to this. So I'm thinking this is a clamp to, to straighten out the horn.